everybody, what's up? So I did a video a while ago covering a program called MPEG Stream Clip. I actually made multiple videos covering this program. I gave an overview of the program and I also told you how to use this program to format your video clips so that you could use them a little bit better with Final Cut Pro. Because if you guys know, if you edit in Final Cut Pro, I'm using Final Cut Pro 7, of course, there's a specific format that these things have to take. It only likes a specific set of codecs, and most cameras don't shoot on those codecs. So a while ago, I showed you guys how to format your clips so that you won't have to do any pre-rendering within Final Cut Pro. And the way I showed you that was pretty simple. The steps for this are going to be pretty much the same. However, I've been using this method for a while, but I've been dragging in the clips one by one. And I didn't actually know that there was a batch export feature until now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys how you can batch export all of your clips with MPEG Stream Clip so that you can have them all formatted for Final Cut Pro. So if you want to go and watch the last tutorial where I actually show you my formatting settings, click the annotation on the screen right here or at the link at the end of this video. And so now I'm going to show you how to batch export. So I have a folder over here for a video that I'm working on called the Technicolor Sin Style video, which is a new picture style that I applied to my Canon T3i. And I have a couple files right here and they're already formatted for Final Cut. And so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to randomly say I want to batch export these video files right here. I want to export them all to the same codec at the same time. So I'm going to load up MPEG Stream Clip down here, which you can download from the link down below. Go to List, Batch List, then go to Add Files, and now choose where you want them. So mine are on the desktop, the Technicolor video, and then here are my videos. So I'm just going to export. Hold on. I was just going to do this. Hold down Control, and I'm just going to select all of these video files. And I'm going to click to Batch, Export to QuickTime, OK. And then it's going to select the output. So I'll just output to the desktop select and then it'll come up with the settings that you want to export to so i normally have a preset for my final cut settings so here's my preset and this is the preset that you guys want and this is also included in the video that i made before and then you just click to batch and click on go and it will automatically export those and they will all just export one after another and one after another and so that way you won't have to do what i've been doing for so long which has just been dragging them in exporting dragging them in exporting and i swear i didn't know that it had a batch feature so i thought if i didn't know it had a batch feature then maybe you guys didn't know it had a uh, had a batch feature so i thought i would just point this out let you guys know give you a little friendly tip so thank you all for watching and i'll see you guys next time goodbye Bye.